What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Emotional, and I'm back for another video. You know what I'm saying? Ah, I just got back to the crib. I ain't got the most energy. I'm a little tired. You know what I'm saying? But I was like, I want to do a vid. You know what I'm saying? I want to do a vid. You know what I'm saying? So today, we're about to get into this Tom McDonald, Dear Rappers. We're going to spread out the extras. I just ask y'all for one, two, three things. Go ahead and hit that subscribe like button, y'all, because we are the sexy, the best of the family on the tube. Turn your post notifications on so you can activate your sexy. And then go ahead and hit that leak a button, y'all, for that's your more premium level sex appeal. Also, cuz said I gotta go back down the rabbit hole. I gotta go all the way back to the beginning. So I was like, all right, I'll go back, way back, back into time. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but without further ado, this is Tom McDonald, Dear Rappers. Y'all know what I like to do. <laughs> Hit him with that what? Hit him with that who? I'm about to watch this bit with you in five, four, three, two, one. Man, it's easy for these rappers who have it all. Talk about the days when they used to be sad. I guess I can't relate to being famous and wealthy. I'm 28 and still praying for the day I have a chance. Maybe y'all can help me out though. I'm just Man. Okay, so this is 2017. So how old is Tom now then? Because I don't, I'm not, I don't, I'm, I'm, I'm not, in, I don't got all the energy to be trying to do no math right now. Like, how old would that make Tom now? Let me know in the comment section. Thank you. Also, I want before I forget, I wanted to apologize to those of y'all that saw the Nova video and I cut the vid short and I apologize. I just didn't think that y'all really wanted to see all that or see me react to all of that at the end. You know what I'm saying? I apologize for that. It won't happen again, Linda. Okay, okay. I don't even want to make my mouth go. I just want to win before the system that I'm in gets a hold of me again and starts to squeeze under my chin until I'm out cold. Dear rappers, can you help me? I'll even take a yeah. selfie with your album that I bought. I got every single CD that you ever fucking dropped. I spent everything I had. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. He, had, he actually took a picture of Eminem's album. <laughs> that's funny. I had and I never had a lot. Oh my god, what a mess. Your words help me deal with the stress. Used to contemplate my suicide the nights I was depressed. Used to pop you in a boom box and sit up on my dad. Cuz struggle with suicide. I forgot he said that in the Angel song. Man, it's crazy how many of us really struggle with like suicide and all that. Cuz I remember I struggled with that at one point in my life. Like the thoughts, you know what I'm saying? Just thinking about it and all that because I felt like I wasn't like good enough for anything or anybody. I just felt like I was worthless. You know what I'm saying? Like, suicide is a very touchy subject, especially because I lost a friend right around the time Kobe died to suicide. Like, suicide is a very touchy subject for me. It's crazy because I, I actually had a lot of people around me try to commit suicide or commit suicide. I never really sat back and thought about it until just now. That's actually crazy. That's actually crazy, wow my desk listen to your music till i felt it in my chest but these days it's like you don't have nothing left your music feels kind of like you're trying to write a check everything is digital i mean no disrespect but i'm paying even more and you give me even less what the fuck you taught me to think you taught me to grow you taught me the things to survive on my own but now you teach me to drink you teach me to smoke you teach me to think every woman's a hoe <laughs> my dog is talking bro <laughs> Dog, like he he's not lying in any way, shape, or form. He's not lying because that's literally what a lot of rappers do. They just teach you to drink, smoke, pop pills, think every girl you can't trust, or every girl is just out for money, or all the dudes is gonna cheat. And folks talk about loyalty, but then preach about not loyalty, and then talk about I want loyalty, but I'm not going to give nobody no chance and all these other chicks is not loyal or the dudes ain't loyal. It's just a lot of confusion in music, in my opinion. Like, I like the fact that he actually attacked that subject because especially the, the part where he said, like, women aren't loyal. Because I'll admit I did go through trust issues and I still deal with it sometimes because, like, my anxiety gets to kicking in because I get to overthinking and thinking, like, okay, what does she want? You know what I'm saying? Like, it'd just be weird. It'd be all over the place. 
bars All your fancy foreign cars Throw your money in my face And try to tell me that it's art No, 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 no No, 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 no. I like these yeah. little time overlays though I can't hear another fucking song about abusing medication that I had to take just to stay alive. There's more important shit than what you wear and where you live and who you fucking, what you drink and what you spend and what you drive. Rappers are <laughs> bullshit. Rappers just a marketing vehicle for the product that the man wants you to buy. Rap about a full clip. Rappers just promoting different liquors and varieties of ways that you could die. Yeah. Mm. Dear rappers, can you help me? Are you almost out of alcohol to sell me? Tell me. Cause drinking every night can be the way to getting wealthy. If I'm really being honest, all the shit is overwhelming. I need someone to look up to. Mm. You're living in a country that elected Donald Trump. You're living in a country where police are killing people every day. And all you want to talk about is doing drugs. You've been blinded by the money. You've been blinded by the cars. You've been blinded by the whip. I see why y'all like him. I definitely see it. Because my dog legit be attacking subjects that folks ain't going to talk about. Or the way that he attacks it is a very interesting way of doing it. You know what I'm saying? It's very direct. It's very in your face. It's aggressive. And like you can't get around it. It's interesting how he attacks the subject versus just saying it. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of folks, they'll be like smooth with it. Or it's like, it's just... Not so in your face with it. Versus him, he's in your face with it. You know what I'm saying? I think it's interesting how he does things, you know? The women don't know who the fuck you are. Thought I knew you when I spent a hundred dollars on a ticket to your show, and now I feel like you stole my fucking money and I'm broke. Man, he taught us how to rap and you taught us how to dress and you taught us how to act if we wanted to impress. Now you're teaching me to live like I know you never would. What you're preaching to these kids is keeping them inside the hood. Yeah, you gonna make a lot of enemies, my boy. You gonna make a lot of enemies. Cause you're telling the truth. You telling folks the stuff that they don't want to hear, like, yeah. Money in my face and try to tell me that it's art. No, 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 no. Just a drug addict, don't I don't it. want your Xanax bars or your fancy foreign cars. Throw your money in my face and try to tell me that it's art. What is he saying on that last part? Because I understand, like, the fancy foreign cars. And then it's, like, the part where he's, like, na 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 Like, that part right before that. What is he saying? Because I can't fully understand it. Like, let me know what he's saying right there. If those of y'all that, like, have heard the song, like, multiple times. Like, let me know, what like, what he's saying right there. No, 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 no. Just a drug addict on TV. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah. That be smooth too. Yeah. 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 All right, y'all. It's the end of that bit. Tom is Tom is different because it's like again, like I said, he will attack a truth, put it in your face, and then you can't say like, "Oh, I'm not gonna listen to dude" because he don't get no views. He get views. You can't say I'm not gonna listen to him because he don't got no money. He got money. You see what I'm saying? Like, he's one of those guys, like, you can't avoid it now. It's like, what is your reasoning for trying to ignore what he's saying? You know what I'm saying? It's just certain artists you just can't ignore when they say something. Like, Tom is definitely one of those guys that you cannot ignore. You can't ignore him for whatever reason. You just can't. You can't ignore him because he's not a good rapper. He's good at what he does. You know what I'm saying? He's very good with the words, you know? So you can't ignore him for that. You, you, he's putting it in your face. He's telling you what's going on and he's telling you his perspective. And I respect his perspective and I like his perspective on it because some of the things that he's saying are things that I actually had to like deal with. Okay, like thinking that you can't trust women. That was a big thing that music had an impact on, but it was also my fault at the same time. So I think a lot of like, of the listeners need to take accountability as well. It's not just the artist promoting it, but it's the people that are overly consuming it. You know what I'm saying? So I think it's the artist, but also I think it's also the consumers too as well. That's just my personal take on it. Let me know what y'all think. Do y'all blame more so the artists or the consumers as far as like why we respond the way that we do to certain things? Also, I've learned not to put artists 
in such a high regard. You know what I'm saying? Like they're just like you idly worship them. You know what I'm saying? Treating them like celebrities, like gods. Like I'm not gonna be like, oh, you're everything that I thought you were. And then when they make a mistake, and then you sitting there like, oh, I knew I couldn't trust you, and all that. Like no, no. But I like what he did with this one. I really like this. Matter of fact, you know the Sultan of Sex. You gotta hit that. Lee K, that's young, you know what I'm saying? But that's all I got for y'all. And I know y'all want to continue this vibe with your boy. I said, with your boy, I can tell you to activate your sexy to the premise of the premium level. And I knew. I said, I knew. You don't want to do this. Lois, let me handle this. Chris, I'm going to say this in a way an Italian mechanic would understand. You're breaking your mother's heart. So since you don't want to break your mother's heart, Lee K, go mint and subscribe. Hey, hey, hey. Turn your post notifications on. I'm emotional. I am gone. Instant transmission. You dig? Expires all your fancy foreign cars. Throw your money in my face and try to tell me that it's our no, no, no. Can I get, can I get, can I get down? You know that I can I get down. Can I get, can I get, can I get down? Me and my squad, we can I get down. Can I get, can I get, can I get down? You know that we can I get down. Can I get, can I get, can I get down?